Guys, you might have already know about look-alike audience because if you are into marketing, many times we listen this term called look-alike audience. But just in case, if you don't know what is this look-alike audience means or how you can use this look-alike audience in uh, your LinkedIn marketing, I'm here to teach you. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to create look-alike audience and how you can use this look-alike audience in LinkedIn ads so that you can bring the best results for your client, for your business or for someone else, right? So let's directly jump into my LinkedIn platform and I'll show you look-alike audience. So guys, as you can see, right now I'm in my LinkedIn profile, right? If I click on home, you'll be able to see my feed, template and all, I mean, uh, timeline and all, right? So let's just directly go to my backend or you can say my campaign manager from where I can create campaigns and all, right? So for that, you need to click on this business icon for business option. And once you click here, you'll be able to see the advertise option. Just click on this. And we are into the campaign manager where we'll be able to see multiple campaign manager accounts. So let's just select one of these accounts. Yeah, let's click on this, the active one, right? And when we land on campaign manager, by default, we land on advertise option where we can see that these are the campaign groups which are already created here, right? Now, let's say I want to create a campaign. So first, if you want to create a campaign, you can create a campaign group. Otherwise, you can create a campaign under this, these campaign groups as well, which you have already created. So this is kind of a folder in which you create multiple campaigns and on those multiple campaigns, you create multiple ads. So this is how the hierarchy works. And why? what is the use of campaign groups? Basically, it helps you to segregate your campaigns, segregate your different type of services or product campaigns, right? because a business doesn't have only one product or service, right? So you might be creating different type of campaigns or different type of ads in that. Now, let's just go with the same campaign. I mean, not. Uh, I'm not going to create new campaign group. I'll go with the campaign group, which is already created. This one, the first one. Just click on this campaign button so that I can create a campaign under this campaign group, right? So click here and the campaign group name is showing here status is active and if you want to change it you can change it as well but i'm not gonna change it i'm just clicking on the next button so that i can proceed with the same campaign group here you can name your campaign whatever whatever the campaign group you want to i mean whatever the name you want to keep it uh let's say i'm like writing look alike oops look alike audience m f g marketing fundas global right this is the name i have given to this right and why i have given because i'm going to run a look alike i mean i'm going to select look alike audience in this campaign right after this you need to select the objective it can be brand awareness website visit or engagement tons of option are here uh, be it awareness consideration or conversion it is totally up to you right let's say uh, I'm, i want to go with brand, uh, website visit or you can say website traffic so just select this one after selecting this, you can scroll a little bit down and here, once you have selected the your objective, you'll be able to see the forecasted results over here, right? Now scroll a little bit down here, you'll be into the audience section where you can select any custom audience or any saved audience or any template, which is, which are uh, directly created by LinkedIn itself, right? So you can select these, but we are not going to select any of these because we want to go with look-alike audience so for that you need to scroll a little bit down in the audience option you'll be able to see look-alike when you click here you'll be able to see that you don't have any look-alike audience right now so if i explain you a little bit about look-alike audience look-alike is basically let's say you have already created an audience or let's say you have linkedin page who have a visitor of 1200 or 2000 on a monthly basis so Obviously, we know that with 2000 visitors or 2000 audience size, we can't run ads, right? Let's say you want to show uh, your ads to the audience who have visited your website. Uh, I mean, not website, your uh, LinkedIn page, your company page. So as we know that we do have only 2000 visitors on our company page. 
So how we can show our ad to those audience? In that case, you can create a look alike audience, which will be not the exact or the same audience who have visited your uh, company page, but their behavior, their interests, their traits will be the same. That is why this is called look alike audience. LinkedIn LinkedIn will find thousands of others uh, audience which will, which will have the same interest, same traits or same uh, kind of behavior who have visited your uh, company page and it is known as look alike audience. So there's a high chances that they will like your product or services because they resembles the audience uh, who have visited your company page. Right. So in that case, you can show your ads to those audience because lookalike audience number is pretty high. It can be 10,000 or maybe 10 million as well. Right. So if you want to create a lookalike audience, first you need to click here and here you will be able to see that you haven't created a matched audience. Lookalike audience needs to be created from matched audience in ready state within at least 300 matched members. So what you need to do is you need to create matched audience first, right? So even uh, if you want, if you can go with this retargeting option, you can create any of these uh, audiences. As you can see here, we do have the company page. So let's say we are creating any company page data. So that is also known as matched audience. So in this, basically we do have this demo, totally demo account. That's why we are not able to hold or we are not able to accumulate 300 members and as it says that at least your matched audience lit list should have 300 members if i click again on lookalike audience you'll be able to see that it should have at least 300 matched members right so matched members can be created in this retargeting option all of these known as uh, matched audience right let's say as i told you that company page who visitors who have uh, visited my company page so I can create a list of those audiences here right as you can see in the previous video I have created and uh, still it is showing building because it takes around 48 hours to populate but I know that uh, it will not reach the 300 uh, mark because this is a demo page demo account and here we are not doing any kind of uh, legit activities so that the audience can visit our page right but i'll show you how you can do that first you need to create a matched audience right as i told you that so matched audience can be created by these you can uh, select the single image so single image is basically when you uh, in previous uh, campaigns you might have created a single image campaign right so people who have engaged with that ad can be used as a matched audience you can create a list of those audience and you can uh, use that list that matched audience list to create your lookalike audience right in the same way it uh, you have this video option then web website option people who have visited your website here you can see website visitors right if i select this one as you can see it is showing that oops your audience size is too small so what you can do is you can use this list to create lookalike audience so people who have visited your website linkedin will find a same kind of people who have same interests same traits same behavior and will create a list of those audience which will be way bigger than 300 members only right so this is how you can use this lookalike audience first you need to create matched audience matched audience can be created in retargeting options tons of option are here after creating matched audience you can go to lookalike audience you can create click on create and here you will be able to see first you need to name the uh, list basically you need to name this audience whatever the name you want to keep and then you need to select the data like which data you want to use to create lookalike audience and that's it you just need to con agree and continue and your lookalike audience will start populating after getting populated after getting 10,000 or maybe 100,000 uh, audience there you can run ads using those lookalike audience and after this you need you can follow the same conventional process you can select the ad format after selecting ad format you can uh, select the placements where LinkedIn is by default and you can go with the 
LinkedIn audience network, which is nothing but a list of third party websites and applications who have rights to show uh, LinkedIn ads on their platform, right? But if you don't want to select, you can just uncheck this box. After that, we do have budgeting and scheduling where you can set your budget on a daily basis, lifetime basis and daily and lifetime basis. Then budget, uh, bidding option where you see optimization goal and bidding strategy. I have already explained about this, these two things. If you don't know, you can check out our LinkedIn marketing playlist and then conversion part. So I mean not conversion part, this is conversion tracking. This is optional. This is basically for the websites because the website doesn't come under LinkedIn's property. So to track uh, your website's data, you need to uh, connect your website with LinkedIn account using inside code right so after filling all these steps you just need to hit the next button and you'll be into the ad setup process where you can set the ad whatever the format you have chosen according to that you need to provide the details and then you can launch the campaign in the fourth step right which is review and launch you can review all the settings and just hit the launch button and your campaign will be launched if you don't know how to create the campaigns in this video my uh aim was to sh show you or to explain you lookalike audience only and if you want to learn about how you can create a full-fledged proper campaign you can check out our previous videos in many videos i have shown you how to create a proper campaign in different different ways using different placement methods using different ad formats right using different objectives i've shown you everything in the playlist right so I hope this video helps and if you still have any question, query, any kind of confusion, you can comment down below. I'll answer those questions in the comment section itself. With that said, I want to take your leave. We'll meet you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.